Once again, Ryan Solo I'm taking a bike, but the price is up this week. The gas is 94 a liter, so 150 pesos to get from the port to my hotel and station two. No ANCAS helmets on Baraka. Ready for another edition of cheap ass, cheapo hotels on Baraka? Well, I got one for you guys today. And it is a fantastic find. As you can see, it's buried back here. Not too glamorous, but the fabulous AJ Travelers Inn. And again, three days, two nights in Barakai for under 2,000 pesos a hat. Yeah, I'm paying about 800, bucks, or 800 pesos a night to stay here. It looks pretty nice, actually. All right, let's take a look at my cheap ass score for the week aircon dual beds in case i have a guest and a, a pretty decent bathroom probably no hot water but it's hot as blazes so i don't care about that the question is can i walk from the resort to the beach in bare feet because it hey how you doing man uh no thanks so go to mama yeah. no no my goodness he liked that so i have definitely been looking for bargains and uh packing avocados and kind of living on the cheap uh, while I've been visiting Barakai this last, this is the fifth weekend. So, I mean, you can definitely do a budget trip and if budget trips aren't your thing, I mean, you can totally go high end here too, you know, no doubt about that. Coming onto the beach, it is windy today. It is not very sunny. And it is rough again for the second week in a row. Which makes for a challenging swim. But I'm going all the way down there. I was pretty amazed when I popped up my head up out of the water after 10 songs. That's sort of how I judge the length of my swim. That I had swam all the way down to where the Starbucks is on the white beach here. And that's a long walk let alone a swim so uh, even though it's probably only an hour in the water I feel pretty drained it was a good hard swim it's pretty rough lots of swells but uh, a very enjoyable and challenging experience I think my last weekend here the goal is going to be to swim the four kilometer beach I'll be happy if uh, if I if I make it halfway. Well, hello, my goodness. Uh, pretty girls, with tons of smiles for me. That never gets old. Got to walk down here by the beach, otherwise uh, I make it snagged by the uh, mask patrol, the mask Nazis. Last weekend I was showing high tide, which comes up to about here. And as you can see, low tide, way out. Lots of seaweed on the beach. You would think that they would find a better place to take selfies. It's just in this one little stretch. decided to come up to Dunk Mall tonight because one of my favorite restaurants in the entire Philippines is here and they make the best calamari in the Philippines. One of my favorite restaurants in Manila 
in Eastwood City at least. And there's also a branch in BGC is the SEMA Greek Tavern. And I think I went to SEMA like three nights a week when I was working in Eastwood. Don't leave home without it. This is the best calamari in the Philippines. All right. We can get Indian food here. It's all the restaurants, the bars, the amenities, the shops that really set Boracay apart as a destination here in the Philippines. Because despite the fact that there are beautiful white beaches here and some of the finest sand in the world, there are tons of beautiful white beaches in the Philippines just not with the amenities. It's always a mob scene on the beach at sundown. But you'll see tomorrow during the day, it won't be like this. This coconut tree is perfectly shaped to be like a comfortable Lining chair. The wind is just incredibly refreshing. It's very relaxing. It's definitely a storm brewing. Hopefully it'll uh, blow through. Shown this uh, in the last couple videos, it's like always a pump in night spot on the beach. And I thought about maybe checking it out tonight, and I would just head head in a little early so I wouldn't have to wait in the line. But then I saw it is one of the few bars on the beach that still charges an entrance fee. Let me don't play that, especially not when there's a ton of great chill bars on the beach where you can just go and sit. And after checking out the Station 3 bars last weekend and finding that cool new club Climax, if I was going to go somewhere with a nightlife vibe, I would just wait till it got a little later and head down there. Which I still might do if I don't pass out. Because that swim just... <laughs> yeah, that wiped me out today. I met this incredible sweetheart on the beach tonight. She's gorgeous. Wow, went back to the room for a quick rest after dinner. When I came back out, the wind picked up like this. I think uh, it's gonna be a serious storm that was in here. But uh, it feels super cool. It's just like really elemental. Like I can already feel the rain blowing in. Cheap spot for breakfast, right in station two. Beautiful day. Cheap breakfast. An avocado, no rice. I am going to attempt to swim the beach again. Today I said I was gonna swim the White Beach and that's about four kilometers. And what I ended up doing was swimming from bottom of station two up to Willie's Rock here, which is a good cliff. I mean, it's, it's over a mile and it felt great. Like, I, I feel like I'm swimming better now than I did when I was 18 years old and I could easily swim the rest of the beach I don't think I'm going to today because I want to add in running to my routine I'm gonna jog back and I don't know how harsh that's gonna be <laughs> so we'll play it we'll play it safe for the day but it's an incredible beautiful windy and sunny day here in Barakai which is surprising considering the hell of a windy rainstorm that blew in last night doggone it's like clockwork here in the philippines man as soon as june hits the rain starts so i don't know if that means the end of summer here but today definitely a summer vibe except for that that chop but that makes for for fun swimming Nine weeks up on. 
almost 16 pounds. There may be a few places in the Philippines where you can beat Boracay for the selfies, but there aren't many. It's amazing here. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe.